the key key piece of deciding on a red carpet dress? Well, I've never worn red before, and when I saw on a red carpet and in a dress, I've worn a red suit, but not done the red dress. So I saw this piece, and I love Jay Mandel, so I thought, hey, with a little bit of Chanel, we're halfway there. Yeah. To be, yeah, that's amazing. <laughs> uh, a little bird tells us that you have written a film. I have. I've co-written a film with my partner Anthony Byrne and we start production when I go back uh, to London, so in a couple of months time. I mean, how long did it take? Was it an idea you've had for a while? Uh, we started writing it five years ago actually. It's a psychological thriller uh, that is set in contemporary London, so you'll see me in jeans and a t-shirt like you do in the forest and moving away from the corsets <laughs> and the semi-automatic rifles with a shaved head, <laughs> just trying to dress like a normal girl. Uh, yeah, so we start shooting in darkness uh, at the end of March, I believe it will be. Thank you. And then, and then uh, I, I know you probably can't say too much about Game of Thrones coming up, but uh, can you talk a little bit about uh, Marjorie and her journey ahead? Uh, what can we expect to see of her in, in the new season? Well, she's not dressing like this anymore. She's, uh, <laughs> she's in effectively a sack in a prison cell. But she's doing her damnedest to get out of it. So uh, your audience will have to watch to see if she does. <laughs> well, uh, Natalie Dormer, thank you yeah, so much. Good pleasure. luck. Very busy year ahead for her. Have a lovely evening. Well. I'm so nice excited about you. your film. That's thank amazing. You. Thank you.